Okay, so picking up where we left off, like, five minutes ago, um, playing level two. So, I guess I'll play it as black first, since I forgot to change it to play as white. Let's go ahead and do that now, so I don't get stuck playing another black game. Okay, I finished the game. Actually, I haven't played much level 2. That one I, my sister played, but... I wanted to do a how-to video for level 1, so I would played that one a lot. But... Does it take on Passant? Yes, opening my e-file, opening this diagonal for my bishop. All of that. have to watch out for this rook now, but... I'm seeing some nice places to put my knights. Let's just kick that around a little. I think that the queen is actually trapped now. Yeah. Okay, so, how to proceed. Go ahead and clear this diagonal for the bishop, maybe get the knight off. The knight is one of the pieces protecting that pawn. Okay. Hmm. Now I suppose I could gang up on this pawn. He could move the rook, but... Whatever. I'll go ahead and do this. Okay, take off that bishop now. Throwing away a piece. And, okay, normally this is the point where I'd say, well, winning a full bishop is better than winning the exchange, but if he takes the knight, then my rook is on his bishop, so. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, so now I'll attack the bishop and the pawn, I guess. As with level 1, level 2 just loves to give away its pieces. So this is bringing the bishop into the attack against the king. Okay, yeah, that does drop an exchange, but... Okay, so now I'm on this pawn. And there's checkmate. Couldn't take because of him. So cool, let's play again. That's my turn as white. And let's go ahead and play some bad chess just to see how quickly we can. this thing. That actually works surprisingly frequently on level 1. It, of course, almost never works against a human player, but
and I do have to be wary of dropping my queen. on that diagonal. <sighs> okay, I discovered attack on the knight. Free knight. Okay, so... Which do I want to take with, um, I think I want to take with my queen, then I can open up over here, maybe, and, hmm. Okay, he is threatening that pawn now, but I don't particularly care. If I moved my knight there, then he could, um, <clears throat> win some material, so let's not do that with him. Move bishop over there, so. Hmm. Don't really care about this, I'm just looking for an attack. This is a direct mate threat. There was probably a mate there if I had bothered to look for more than two seconds. Kind of figured that there was and just lazily moved. The early levels of chest titans are just so pathetic, though. That it really can be hard to care. Okay. <clears throat> now the threat with that move was if he had moved a pawn, um, and I would have had my knight here, which would have been fairly devastating. Okay, so now check. Yeah, this looks to be mating. Okay, so just like the last video, a bit sloppy on my part, but this should get more interesting as the levels ramp up. That's me against Chest Titans level 2. Thanks for watching. Let's go all the way to 10.